afternoon, everybody. Hello. It's Friday. Anyways, I just put a, I guess you call it compilations with different pictures and might be a few talking in there. I'm not really sure. I've been busy. It's been a busy week. Uh, my grandson at one point, my youngest one had a hockey game. He took a few pictures of some trees for me on the way back. Uh, my other grandson, Dante, he played uh, football last night. Took a couple of pictures of those. Yeah, that's Durham. Oh, no, that's that, that one. Oh, no, Dante. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah. Anyways, yeah, just uh, I've been making a few little things and making some robots and stuff and yeah, I just did one here, you know. This goes on, like, this is something you can, you can have. It doesn't make noise like the other ones do, but, you know, it's a conversation piece anyways. This one here, you can hang it up in your rear view mirror. You know, there you go. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I just threw that together. I made one for my daughter. That was pretty cool. Uh, yeah. So... Yeah, it's just a short little hi, how are ya? A few pictures in it and stuff like that and anything I've been doing over the week. It's been really cold here. Uh, at times, past past week it's been cold and hot. Up to the 20s, 22, 23 I think. And today I think it's at, uh, it's at 1. So yeah, we just got back from going to Popeye's with my grandsons did some work around the house. so. We went out to Popeye's this afternoon. I just got back, so I thought, guess what? I better put in a video or something, so. Peace, I hope you enjoy it. Aloha. Uh, I love you. Oh yeah, I seen a picture of Raven's feet the other day. Hey Raven, you know, you had red, red nail polish lost a toe, if it was bleeding, it all matches. You wouldn't know it. You know, it all looked the same doing about 50 down the road. So. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you're doing well. Uh, and yeah, oh, I have a driving, uh, I have a driving date coming up on the 3rd. I'm still waiting for more, but I mean, I got one already booked, so I'm gonna have to do that one, which is good. And uh, yeah. Shout out to everybody that's out there that follows me, texts me, and I still have to get uh, my stuff monetized, and I'm going to do that maybe this weekend if I, well, if I, I'll have time, I'm sure, and if a uh, person is going to help me, if they have time, that would be great. If not, well, we'll figure it out. Anyways, peace, Andy. Thanks for calling like yesterday. I appreciate it, and uh, y'all have a great weekend. I love you all. Until next time. Bye-bye. Well, good morning. Yeah, we're heading out. I have to take the, my youngest uh, grandson to his bus. And I also have to uh, well, come back or whatever. Yeah, because you can tell it's garbage day out today. I got to come back and uh, go uh, have a doctor's appointment at 11 o'clock. Then I got to go to the other end of the city, so it's going to be a little bit of an adventure. There's a young one. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> We're off to school. Ciao for now. Uh, good afternoon, everybody. We're sitting here on a, it's like a bike path walkway. I just came back from uh, doctors, Walmart. I tried everywhere. Got one more place to try. Uh, try to get them tickets so we can do the lucky number. Anyways, no luck. It's a gorgeous day out today. So, uh, yeah. I'm just sitting here. I just figured I'd do it. Sorry if there's noise. But, yeah. We're just sitting here, you know, doing our thing. One of the things, I mean, not complain about, I mean, like, I don't want to always complain, but one of the things that bothers me lately 
is, it seems like every document that I apply for, I talked to this lady online about my CPP and stuff. Anyways, she said, yeah, what's your address? I gave her my address, my resident one now in Ontario. And she said, okay, I'll get that right out to you right away. And I thought, well, great, man, thank you. Well, I just got a call from my friend in BC where I used to use her place for an address. And that's been like a few years now. Anyways, she phones me up and tells me, oh, I got a package for you. And I said, holy jeez. And I don't know why, because I mean, like, I changed all my addresses. I truly have. But anyways, you know, so that... That's a little bit of an annoyance. I mean, I, it seems like I always have to check up, check up on people all the time. It doesn't matter who it is or. Hey there. Hello, how are you? Good, you? Yeah, so uh, yeah, there's been some people drive by the bike. I don't know. Can't change the world, I can only change myself. And that's, you know, that's why I try to tell people, that's why I try to tell my grandsons, because they all get in trouble because one does something. And, and I said, all you can do is just govern yourself. If you're doing what you need to do, don't worry about anybody else, you know. Yeah, because this morning I woke up and I ended up getting, uh, ended up waking up with phones, iPads, tablets, uh, uh, VCRs, all that stuff on my bed. I said, what are you doing? I won't be able to get out of bed. My daughter says, well, they're not getting it. I said, okay. So, yeah, that happens every now and then. Anyways, I'm sorry if it's a little no noisy, but I'm away from the traffic, unless there's somebody that comes right in front of me. But, uh, yeah, uh, just a little bit of an update. I'm having a battle with my insulin and doctors trying to, you know, doctors are not really the doctor, but the nurse who's a diabetic herself, I found out. She's trying to balance it and, you know, it's getting better, but it's still got a ways to go. But yeah, I've been taking a lot of insulin, so I have to move it, I have to move it around my body a little bit because I think my gut I know my gut looks big, but it's not all, uh, today, my gut looks big, but it's not all fat. It's a lot to do with just constant poking myself with needles and stuff. It's hard, and I guess the insulin doesn't get in there like it should, so, yeah, I have to do some adjustments. Hopefully that'll help out. But on that note, yeah, I'm just, it's a lovely day. I'm just coming back. I stopped in at, uh, uh, at the grocery store, I don't, I, I've been not spending money outside, so I mean, but today I decided, well, I'm gonna, I haven't eaten yet, so I was gonna get some chips, or chicken and uh, onion rings, so I got a small thing of that, uh, yeah, and now I'm heading home, um, and I just thought, you know what, you know, I guess I, I was watching Chrome the other day, and Chrome did that, like, you know, but he, you know, he's got Better stuff than I got, but uh, he said, "Yeah, let's get let, let's put his Starlink up there." And he said, "I can do it outside the van." So I thought, you know what? Yeah, maybe I'll try it. I know it's a little bit. Hopefully, y'all can hear me, but I know it's a little bit. Uh, it's 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 different. But I hope y'all hear me, and uh, we'll check it out. And don't forget what I said the other day. You know, you got comments. You want you want me to talk about anything? Feel free to put it down. Uh, you know, I'll talk about, you know, I'll talk pr pretty much about anything, you know. Just remember, be nice. <laughs> but yeah, you know, I'll do my best to answer your questions if you have any. Anyways, okay, on that note, I'm going to uh, head her on home. And uh, love you all. Peace out. Oh, I love you. Peace out. <laughs> yeah. Thumbs up. And wherever you are, wherever you go, hope you're safe on your travels. And, uh, yeah.
you know, you might have a bad day today, that's fine. Get through that. Hopefully tomorrow will be a better day. Okay, I'll talk to you later. I believe 17 is my grandson. <laughs> 